It's March 16th all day, and these historical events occurred on March 16th, this date in history. In 1621, Native American Chief Samosat and Abenaki Sagamore visits the colony of Plymouth, Massachusetts. In 1641, General Court declares Rhode Island a democracy and adopts a new constitution. In 1802, the first U.S. Military Academy at West Point is established through Congressional Act, and it was opened July 4th, 1802. Remember that date, students. In 1836, the Constitution of the Republic of Texas is approved but legalizing slavery. Speaking of the Republic, I mean the state, I mean the Republic, I mean the state of Texas. In 1861, Edward Clark becomes governor of Texas, replacing Sam Houston, who's evicted from office for refusing to take the oath of loyalty to the Confederacy. He just said, I'm not doing it. He told his wife, I'm not doing it, not gonna do it. In 1870, Hiram Revels makes the first official speech by an African American in the U.S. Senate. Yep, that was happening. Right after Reconstruction, uh, African Americans had great access to political power. There he is. 1926, Robert H. Goddard launches the first liquid-fueled rocket, and it goes 184 feet. Woo! Uh, I would not play with, do not play with it like that if I were you. It's not a toy. Speaking of rockets, in 1966, Gemini 8 is launched with Neil Armstrong and David Scott aboard, conducting the first docking of two spacecraft in orbit. Although the flight was aborted after a critical system failure, with the crew returned safely to the Earth, obviously. Okay, are you ready for this? In 1995, Mississippi's House of Representatives formally abolishes slavery and ratifies the 13th Amendment to the Constitution. In 1995. Honestly, I, I, I don't understand why that would have taken so long. Speaking of oppressive slavery, hi, North Korea. And in 2016, U.S. college student Otto Wambier is sentenced to 15 years hard labor for trying to steal a political poster in North Korea. When they finally got to return him, he was in a coma and died later. I think we owe you one for that one. No need to steal here. I'm giving it away for free. And when it comes to a battle of wits, you'll have the victory when you subscribe to my channel for this date in history. Like, share, subscribe, plus check out those comments below and contribute for even more March 16th history. I made that rhyme up at the last minute.